everyone. So this isn't going to be a beauty video as such. I just felt like sitting down and talking to you guys um, and sort of letting you get to know me a bit more because I feel like when I film my videos I'm very awkward and I'm trying my hardest to remember all of the information about the products that I need to tell you guys and all this stuff and it's almost scripted in a way because every time when I sit down to film a video I will think about what sort of video I want to do and then I'll think about exactly what I'm going to say, what is my intro going to say, what do I need to say in my intro, what am I saying in my outro, what am I saying in the bulk of the video. I've just got makeup on my brother's computer, or is it chocolate, I don't know. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so I kind of plan out exactly what I'm going to say and all of the information that I'm trying to say and when I come down, when I sit down to actually film, I'm trying to remember all of the things I want to tell you and say to you about what I'm doing and there's like so many different takes so I'll start and I'll be like hey everyone and I'll start talking and they'll be like ugh no that didn't come out right or oh I forgot to put this bit in so then I have to start over again and it just I come across very awkward I think and very sort of stiff and formal and that's not me at all like any of my friends will know I'm such a dork and um yeah that's not me at all and I think as well because I watch a lot of um, YouTube videos, beauty videos, and the gurus that I watch are in America, I hear their voice and their accents and everything and they just sound so relaxed and comfortable and confident <clears throat> and then I hear my voice and it's it sounds even more British and I don't know if when I film I subconsciously like talk more British and pronounce things and things like that because I feel if I don't, basically I'm from an area in England that is kind of country bumpkinish, I guess. It's a farmer area and I don't want to come across as like this kind of backwards person and not that, you know, farmers or, you know, anyone in this area is a backwards person, but I just feel like that kind of accent that I have and that I've been brought up listening to kind of makes me come across as being a bit dumb and not dumb, but just, I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Um, Oh, do you like my slippers? I love my slippers. They keep my feet nice and warm. See, that's the sort of person that I am. And I feel like when I talk, I'll not pronounce things properly and I'll sound very Norfolk, basically. And I don't want to sound like that because that's not who I am. I mean, I guess it is, but I just don't like sounding like that. But I don't know. So then I feel like I have to talk properly and pronounce things properly and then because I have that thing where like two words will get meshed together and I won't pronounce things properly I then have to start over again for that sentence or whatever and then I get frustrated at myself and it's just such an ordeal like the video I did on my um, recommendations for your first Mac purchase one that was awful it took so many takes to do it I mean I didn't sort of film it and then go back and refilm the whole thing but just so many takes of each little bit, it was such a nightmare and I wanted to get it right because it was something that had been requested and I wanted to make sure I gave enough information and all the rest of it and I just, I really don't like that video to be honest. So I just wanted to sit down and talk to you guys um, but other than that I don't really know what I want to talk about, I just kind of want you guys to get to know me a bit better. Um, so if you have any questions you want to know anything about me, just leave it in a comment below or send me an email or something and I'll either respond, if there's not that many questions I'll respond to you directly or if there's quite a few then I'll probably do an FAQ video. But yeah, if you want to know anything just ask, um, you know as long as it's not too personal then I'll answer it. Um, I don't really know. This is a really short video, it's only been four and a half minutes so far. Um, I don't really know what else to say though, I just wanted to sit down and just feel more comfortable in front of the camera and act more natural, I guess. Um, but now I don't really know what to talk about so it's kind of pointless, I don't even know if I'm going to post this video or not. I don't know. Um, I'm at 89 subscribers, so I'm really excited about that, soon I'll be at 100. And I don't know whether or not to do a giveaway video when I reach 100 subscribers. Um, I'll see where I'm at in my life 
sort of financially at the time. Um, because if I have the money, then I'm more than happy to do a giveaway if you guys want a giveaway video. Um, but it just depends on whether or not I have any money. Because at the moment, I don't. And as you know, I was traveling for six months. I got back and I had basically no money. And then I had three weeks when I was back and I didn't have work. And then I've only just started work a couple of weeks ago. And I don't get paid until the 26th. So I have to wait till the 26th till I, till I have any money. At the moment, I'm having to borrow money from my dad and my brother just so I can put petrol in my car to get to work and back. And, you know, just basic things like food and stuff like that. So I don't really have any money to spare at the moment, but when I do, I will for sure do a giveaway video to thank you guys for subscribing, because you're amazing, I love reading your comments, and I love that people actually watch my videos, I never thought that they would, I didn't think that, you know, people would watch my videos, like, that's just crazy to me, you know, there's so many other gurus out there that are so much better than me, that have better knowledge, and more products, higher quality products, and they know how to apply them. So like, why would you watch me when you can watch them instead? But it really means a lot to me that you guys do watch me. And I'm so, so thankful and grateful for every single one of you. You don't know what it means to me that you've subscribed and you watch my videos. So thank you. Yeah, I've just filmed my everyday makeup routine, which is what I've got on right now. There's nothing that exciting, just... I felt in a filming mood today, so I filmed that. I hadn't planned on it. I I'm planning on filming an updated what's in my bag video later on today. But then I was getting ready and I thought, you know what, I'll film my everyday makeup routine since I'm doing it, you know. So I filmed that and now I'm filming this and then after I film this I'm going to go out shopping, which I know I said I don't have any money, but I have a store card for this one shop that I'm going to go to, New Look. So I'm going to get some things on the store card, hopefully, if they've got what I need. Basically there's a girl at work that is that goes to the gym nearby our work and they do exercise classes so I want to start going to them with her and there's one on Monday that she's invited me to but I don't have any workout clothes so I need to go and find some workout clothes and see if I can find some more clothes for work because I don't have that much and then maybe buy a new bag because I don't like my bag at the moment I guess I'll show you what's down here this is it this is from New Look as well and I mean, I guess it's like a medium-sized bag. It's not. It looks huge on the screen, but it's not this big, really. Um, and it's got lots of, like, there's a pocket here, and there's a zip here, and a zip here, and there's pockets at both sides, and there's a pocket inside, and it holds quite a lot, but I think it's just looking a little bit ratty now, so I want to get a new bag. And the one that I had in Australia got completely destroyed, which I'll talk about that in my updated What's My Bag video when I do it, but... I'm going to see if there's any good bags for sale, new look, and hopefully get one of those as well. And then I need to get a couple of things from Boots, some beauty products, and to get some face wash and moisturiser and stuff like that. So um, I've got some points on my Boots card as well, so I can use them to pay for that. So that's again not spending any money. So I'm going to go do that, and then when I get back I'm going to film my updated what's in my bag video. And then, I guess I'll sit down and start editing some of these things together. I don't know what I'm going to put up first, if I'll do this video or if I'll do the What's in My Bag video. But this is quite good that, you know, I'm going to have filmed three videos today. And then I can put them up, like, throughout the week. Um, and then, I guess, just some chores. I've got some clothes washing to do and my room kind of needs a bit of a tidy up. It's a bit of a mess, like... This stuff over here is kind of a bit of a mess and needs tidying up and stuff on my makeup desk and my computer desk and the floor, everything's just kind of a mess at the moment. So I'll be doing that. Um, and that's about it really. So it's Easter next weekend, I think, isn't it? Yes, yeah, Easter weekend next weekend, or the bank holiday weekend, so that's really exciting. Um, but I'm um, really strange. I used to love, love, love chocolate, but now I'm not fussed. I'm not thinking, oh, it's Easter, I'm going to get Easter eggs. I mean, not that I really get Easter eggs anyway, but I'm really not fussed. I'd rather have, like, lush products, to be honest. I'd much rather have somebody buy me, like, 
one of the Lush Easter eggs or the hippie chicks. I really want to try one of the hippie chicks because they look so cute and I love the smell of the happy hippie shower gel. Not that I've tried it, but I've smelt it in the store and I love that smell. Love Lush. <laughs> um, which if you follow my blog, you'll definitely notice how much I love Lush from my earlier posts because um, I used to do tons of Lush reviews. So if you haven't seen my blog, I'll link that below. Um, so you can go check that out if you're interested in Lush or anything like that. Um, but yeah, I'd much rather have some like a bath bomb from Lush instead of an Easter egg. So much rather that. So maybe I'll go to Lush. Not that I'm going to buy anything, but just go and smell l yummy products. Um, what are you guys' plans for Easter? I'm not really planning on doing much. I'm seeing my fiancé, and I think we're going to go to the cinema, but we don't think we're really going to do much. Um, let me know if you want any Easter inspired videos um, just leave a comment below and I'll see what I can do for you because I don't really have any Easter videos planned I will see you in my next video bye